Hello everyone, I believe that you have gone through the quick start video. Now let's check the basic power user guide. First of all, Zentao is a professional project management tool based on the Scrum methodology and CMMI philosophy. It integrates multiple features to cover the entire software development lifecycle. Let's log in Zentao. Here you can set your Zentao language firstly. There are thousands of buttons in Zentao, and maybe you will feel a little bit confused and don't know where to start. Be honest, there is no need to know the meaning of every button. Normally, Zentao users only need to focus on the module might to check the tasks assigned to them, and then start the task. Record the effort. Until finish the task. And finally close the task. That's all. You know, Zentao is an application lifecycle management tool. So, let's start from the top hierarchy, Program. Program is a set of related projects, it's a broader and bigger goal set by top managers or executives, which expresses the business strategy. For example, we have two totally different business lines in California, one is the research and development center while another is real estate transaction. So, here we could create two independent programs. And in the program of our ND center in California, we have a sub-program, Intelligent Production and Research, which including two projects, Software Development Part, which is Intelligent Software Operating System and Hardware Manufacturing Part, which is Wearable Device. You also have the Kanban view allows you to check the status of all the programs and projects. If you are not used to the concept program or think it's difficult to understand or whatever, no problem, just leave it here or close it in the back end and you can use the module project only. It's up to you, everything in Zentao is flexible. Product is the final deliverable. No matter if you are from a product-based project team, for example, you manufacture a mobile phone or router as the deliverable, or you are from a non-product-based project team, such as a customized platform as the deliverable. In both scenarios you need to have a result to show to your end users. This result we call product in Zentao. Generally speaking, the product owners or product managers will take care of this module. Here we have a dashboard to check the product's overview and POS can add or hide blocks as their need. Now let's check a specific product. Firstly let's go to the product list view or Kanban view. As you can see, there are so many products. So here we have different tags such all, open, and close to classify the products. We can even search the product directly. For example, I fill in bracelet and click search, here we can get all the results. Let's click its name Smart Sports Bracelet to check the product details. Product owners will collect user requirements and put them in the Epic pool. Epic describes something big, sometimes it may be just a goal and without product details. So product owners need to do further analysis and break them into the development feasible unit, which is story. If it's a multiple branches product, we can check stories by trunk or branches, and we can also check stories by different modules. As you can see, here we have a lot of stories maybe 100 of stories and it's impossible to implement them all at one time. So product owners will create plans and link a certain number of stories. When the organization decides to start the plan, the project manager will create a project. There are two ways to create a project, in the product module or in the project module. As we can see, there are five frameworks available for your project to follow, Scrum, Waterfall, Kanban, Agile Plus, and Waterfall Plus. Here I'd like to take Scrum project as an example. There is an option of parent program. Select one from the drop-down list if the project belongs to a program. Otherwise just leave it blank. It's flexible. Give the project a name and a code. Code could be a set of numbers, and it's for the convenience to distinguish the different projects. Multi-iteration and product-based type is set default. With the default setting of the product-based type, POS could manage all the stories in product module. If you select non-product-based type, there will be one less hierarchy, POS could just manage stories under the project, and no need to link stories from product module. Please kindly notice that only the fields with the red stars are must be filled, others fielded are optional. I believe that you are familiar with setting the manager, budget, project duration, 
link product and plan. Access control. So here I will jump these parts and click save directly. Then we can find it on the project list. Now we will go to project settings to set the team members. So, until now, we have set a project and we have a team to do this project. But how to do? Where is the specific tasks? That's why we have to create iteration first in the project. You know, we have five types of project management framework in Zentao, such as Scrum and Waterfall. In Scrum, we called it iteration or sprint, but in Waterfall, it's called phase or stage. So, here we just combine these concepts and give it a unit name execution. You can check execution in the left sidebar or maybe you have found that when I click create iteration, it jumped to the page execution automatically. Same way, here we need to fill in some basic information about the iteration and set the team members. After save, there is a pop put reminder. Next step we could choose to link stories. You know, in Scrum Framework, developers need to participate in the spread planning meeting and make sure that they understand each user story. So here we need link the stories to this iteration and then split those stories into tasks for further development. Here we click this button to create tasks for this story, or click this button to create tasks in batch. Here we get tasks, team members will adopt their favorite tasks and click assign to themselves. For example, Philip is good at this task, so he will assign the task to himself. And then he will start the coding and record his effort until finish all the tasks. Like I have mentioned in the very beginning, most Zentao users only need to focus on my work. But as a project manager, definitely he or she needs to getting to know more about the current project. So here we have the burn down chart for project managers to check if there is any risks of delay. Besides, we have some other views which is praised by many Zentao users, such as the Gantt chart, it's easy to drag the lines to edit the task's dependency and duration, to show it by day, week, or month. We have grouped you for your convenient to check tasks by different groups. For example, we can check group by assigned to, to check the team workload, how many hours spent and how many hours left for a dedicated task. What's more, we have BI module for you to check more than 40 kinds of charts and if these data reports can't satisfy you, you could customize your own SQL report. For more information please go though our video guide about BI. Let's continue with the basic use of Zentao. Now we have implemented all the tasks and stories in the first plan, but we don't know if it's qualified code or not. So it's time to submit to QA test. Firstly, it's needed to create a build. The build is for the internal test, not for the public release. Then link stories and link bugs if necessary. We can submit the test request now. So, in this way, we have confirmed the testing scope. The first thing the test engineer to do after receiving the request is to link the use cases. You know, there are two parallel lines, the testers are writing use cases while the developers are coding. So, here the tester only needs to link the use cases to the request. And then, the tester will run the case to verify if he can get the expected result, if he does, pass the case, otherwise, click fail and report it as a bug. If it's an urgent bug, you can assign it to the responsible developer and solve it as soon as possible. If not urgent, you can link the bug to the next iteration. Now we have finished all the work in a build. We will repeat the procedure above, until all the stories have been implemented. And then the PO will create a public release in Zentao system. And link all the stories and bugs. The entire software development lifecycle is finished. As you can see in this video, only several modules are got involved in the process and we can manage the entire software development lifecycle. There are still several buttons that I didn't get in touch. Amazing, right? Zentao is so powerful. As for other features please go through other videos to check the details. Thanks for your watching and listening. See you next time.